Faith has a very bad press these days. It's regarded as the poor cousin of knowledge. And I think that this attitude reveals some confusion about faith. Faith, as I understand it, is relying on something as if it were so. It means you are prepared without thinking to act as if it were so. We have faith in our car mechanic, in our dentist, in our watch. I'm demonstrating faith right now, faith in my chair. If I didn't have faith in my chair, I wouldn't be sitting here like this. That is faith. That is what reliance is. And we live by faith every day. Some of my children believe they are going to get a university degree they haven't got yet. And they are going to get that degree, probably. And what is going to bring that degree into reality is confidence that they will get it, together with acting as if it were going to happen. And that is what will bring it into reality. And if they didn't believe that, it wouldn't happen. And that is true of faith. So for me, what I'm saying is faith in God brings into reality that which otherwise would not be. Faith is a confidence that leads us to interact with reality in such a way that a result comes. When I have faith and go and switch on the light switch, the lights don't come on because I have a little thing called faith inside me. The lights come on because my faith led me to act and my action tied into a power, a reality, and that brought a result. So you see, the prayer of faith is a way of God sharing his power with us. And Jesus is clear that this faith is a growing thing. It's like a mustard seed initially, but it grows as we realise more and more we are connecting with an interactive God. Loads more to say, but for now, have faith.